Hello, I'm Alicia, and if this is your first time visiting my channel, welcome. I forgot to bring up a very important point yesterday. This arrived in the mail, and it's not Condi, but it's Kool-Aid. And I want to talk about some of my favorite foods during this pandemic and even any other time. Okay, so... Usually they don't have some of these Kool-Aids in the store, so check this out. Can anybody tell me if they can find green apple? Or, let's see. Mandarin, tangerine, let's see. My nail's in the way, my bad. Mandarin, tangerine flavor, like I have not seen this in the stores. See, I haven't even seen peach mango in stores. Um, I'm a Kool Aid freak, if you haven't already noticed. Chocolate fan, I think I've seen this one in stores. It's one of my favorites. Oh my god, it's so good! And so, sometimes you can order these online and find look. That's a noise and mating call I make when I'm hungry or want food. Oh, here we go. Oh yeah, my friend Christina Bender got married today, so congratulations to Christina and Donnie. Let's see, I'm gonna drink a little bit in your honor. To Christina and Donnie. Yeah, it's about to get real interesting with a little liquor in my system. <laughs> yeah, but oh, I've been really um getting into nuts. I mean, the food kind. Get your mind out the gutter. This is not that kind of video. Almond nuts, and um, I also like to make snacks for my squirrels outside with nuts. I actually um get some toilet, some old toilet. You know those things that come out of the toilet um, paper when you're done? The little brown square, the brown tubey things that when you're done. Okay, so after I'm done using toilet paper, put some peanut butter on it. Either I'll put some nuts, M&Ms, and they love it. They'll even come on my porch going, ee wee wee wee. They'll knock on my door. If I don't put nothing out, they will knock on my door until I put something out. So they really love the snacks I create for them. Love fortune cookies. <gasps> Snow covered sun belt bakery. Oh, Lord have mercy. And by the way, this is not a healthy food video. So if you're looking for all healthy food, you're not going to get it. You're going to get Porky Pig Alicia because Hungry Hippo is hungry. When I get hungry, I want food and I want snacks. So you might get a mix of healthy food, but you're also going to get some fattening food. And this is what this is. Okay, so, Nutri Grain. Oh my god. Strawberry. I also like, um, my favorite Pop Tarts are strawberry Pop Tarts. Oh my gosh. Lord have mercy. <laughs> oh, I love strawberry Pop Tarts. They're the best. Of course, I think second place can be blueberries. But number one is definitely strawberry Pop Tart. Let's see. This is what I got from. Oh, yeah. No thing I got from my squirrels. Without making too much noise. My goodness. Okay, so. We got this big old thing of corn for them. So every day. Or every other day. They will get some corn out there for them. I really like to spoil my animals. You know, I, if I'm around, no animal's going to go hungry. I'm going to make sure my cats, my squirrels, everything gets fit. Okay. This is one of my favorite ginger ales. This bold. I love it. It tastes amazing. 
when I first had this with some tequila, I was like, oh, wee. Coarse water. I've been drinking a lot of water before this pandemic, but especially now. Cream soda is good. Dr. Pepper by itself is good. Cream soda by itself is good. So when you combine it too, hi yay yay. Okay. Orange vanilla. Coca Cola is good. Same thing with um cold red Mountain Dew. Oh, you know another one I really like is um Sprite Tropical Mix. They don't sell it a lot of places, but it is the bomb.com. Sprite Tropical Mix. Whew. And, well, by the way, by next week, it's, it's going to all be different because more likely all of these is going to be gone. After a workout, ooh, I'm just ready to chow down. This I haven't even opened yet. This is from 4th of July. Sparkling Ice Fruit Punch. I'll be interested to see what this tastes like because sometimes when it doesn't have a lot of calories in it, it doesn't taste as good. So I'll let y'all know how that tastes. Let's see. What else could I talk about? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh yeah. I wish they had urban cold house pizza across the country. It's only in New Jersey. It's some of the best pizza I've had in my life. Of course, I'll go to um, uh, Donato's, Pizza Hut, Bass Bowls, all those good places. But the more I travel, I find all these great pizza places, especially in New York City. Hallelujah. Oh, of course Chicago has some good pizza, but New York is killer. Ooh. But Urban Cold House Pizza, and I sometimes mistake it for Urban Soul House Pizza, especially when I have wine. But literally, that's some of the best pizza I've had in my life. And I dream about it, and I cannot wait until we meet up again. Oh, and then Varsity down in Atlanta. Peach fry pie and apple fry pie. Oh my god. Oh, Ooh, if I could have those two together in one meal, my heart. Oh, I love those two so much. And then out in California, they got Donut City. Oh, I mean, of course, I know there's a lot more places I got to explore out in LA. I'm not as familiar with LA like I am in New York in Indian Chicago but I'm getting there <sighs> that's the noise I make when I see and taste something really good <sighs> there it is <sighs> when I make those noises please just get out of my way because I'm just ready to eat I'm just staring at the food and all and I'm about to go now, I'm about to have some chili for dinner tonight. So what are you guys going to eat for dinner? After talking about urban cold house pizza, I really have a hankering for pizza. And oh, I love egg drop soup and egg rolls. Oh my gosh. Like, I had a hankering for them and had it like a couple weeks ago and man. I'm almost ready to uh, go for round two, three, four, five, six. And of course, I love um, burritos with queso sauce. Oh my God, just put that queso all over that burrito and let me at it. Even if I had to cut it in half and eat one half and then take another half home with me. Ho, 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 ho. So, what is your favorite pandemic foods? And like I said, this this is going to definitely change weekly. You know, by tomorrow I might have a hankering for spinach and corned beef and because I love corned beef and cabbage. I love corned beef sandwiches too. So I'm telling you about tomorrow I might be having a hankering for it. 
And, you know, by the next day, I might want some Junior's hamburgers. You know, Junior's is a good hamburger place in New York. Oh, my gosh. Oh, they have these big old shakes. Oof. When I first put my lips into that fat hunk of meat and bread, I was about to go crazy. Woo. So my hankerings and my fantasies about food changes on a daily basis. <laughs> the point is, I just really like to eat. I love food. And I think my all-time favorite cereal is definitely Frosted Cheerios. Of course, I could go for other Cheerios, but the thing about Frosted, like, mm, obsessed. So, let me know what your favorite foods are. Uh, let's talk about it. I'm gonna eat. You know, maybe after this pandemic is over, and in the future, we can all go out to eat virtually. And when it's safe, and like I said, when we can, we'll get together. And when we can't, I'll still come virtually. You know, I can just be sitting right there next to you eating. And oh, uh, whatever town you're from, tell me like some of your best restaurants and your best, you know, dives, like favorite foods. Like if I was coming to your town today, where would you take me to go get some to eat? <laughs> oh, I'm going to go ahead and clock off but I really like popcorn from the movies oh god that butter oh. oh yeah you put that butter and salt on that movie popcorn oh man I can just go to a place just to get the popcorn and leave I don't even have to watch movies oh oh butter popcorn oh my gosh yes Ooh. so let me go ahead and uh chow out and like I said again Congratulations to Christina and Donnie. And uh, I'll talk to everybody later. Cheers.